Heavens no, said Rich Dad. The government always takes its cheer first. More money seldom solves someone's money problems. Intelligence solves problems. Having been an employee all his life, and trapped in the mental, maximum security prison known as job security, he did not know how to recover from his failures or learn from his mistakes, much less how to start over to replace his paycheck and his pension. Rich Dad encouraged Mike and me to know a little about a lot. He encouraged us to work with people smarter than we were and to bring smart people together to work as a team. Today it would be called a synergy of professional specialties. Section 1031 of the Internal Revenue Code which allows a seller to delay paying taxes on a piece of real estate that is sold for a capital gain through an exchange for a more expensive piece of real estate. Real estate is one investment vehicle that has a great tax advantage. As long as you keep trading up in value, you will not be taxed on the gains until you liquidate. Find mentors who have already successfully made the crossing before. Financial struggle is often the result of people working all their lives for someone else. Subconscious moment, the situation you fear most is the skill that you need to learn and conquer. And you may have to force yourself to do it, though like going to the gym you'll be glad you did. What? My first day as an entrepreneur was not off to a very good start. It is said that the fear of public speaking is a fear greater than death for most people. According to psychiatrists, the fear of public speaking is caused by the fear of ostracism, the fear of standing out, the fear of criticism, the fear of ridicule, and the fear of being an outcast. The fear of being different prevents most people from seeking new ways to solve their problems. That is why my educated dad said the Japanese valued the power of the mirror the most, for it is only when we look into it that we find truth. Fear is the main reason that people say, play it safe. That goes for anything, be it sports, relationships, careers, or money. It is that same fear, the fear of ostracism, that causes people to conform to, and not question, commonly accepted opinions or popular trends. People's lives are forever controlled by two emotions, fear and greed. Offer them more money and they continue the cycle by increasing their spending. This is what I call the rat race. But the truth is that you let life push you into submission. Deep down you were terrified of taking risks. You really wanted to win, but the fear of losing was greater than the excitement of winning. Deep inside, you and only you will know you didn't go for it. You chose to play it safe. Buying a luxury on credit often causes a person to eventually resent that luxury because the debt becomes a financial burden. If fear keeps you prisoner in one of the financial quadrants, I recommend reading Emotional Intelligence by Daniel Goleman. The reason is the same reason many people don't start their own businesses. It can be summed up in one word, risk. One businesses that do not require his presence, he owns them, but they are managed or run by other people. If he has to work there, it's not a business. It becomes his job. Two stocks. Three bonds. Four income generating real estate. Five notes, yes. Six royalties from intellectual property such as music, scripts, and patents. And I read about Donald Trump, trying to find out how he negotiates and puts deals together.